environmental issues have been challenging targets in the scheme of building new star rural areas in numerous localities. Aware of this, the Women's Union of Namsek District, Haizung Province, has established a model of voluntary environmental protection, which has proven effective. This 2km road connecting Big Day and Hoang Sa hamlets of Namsek District looks neat thanks to local women's hard work. In the beginning of August, the community government and leaders provided the Women's Union with a small fund to plant flowers along the street. Realizing the benefits of planting flowers, most local women voluntarily contributed their own money and time to clean the street. Thanks to their enthusiasm, the street had a new beautiful look after only a month. The grass was so bad that some spirits were dampened. Well, actually it is a bit, but people are happy as now they can walk on beautiful streets. Apart from the road, many streets and roads in Namching Komu have been cleaned and decorated with flowers. Working on the tidy streets, local people are proud of what they have done. The street used to be a mess. After the flowers were planted, people have kept the street clean. Not even a straw can be found along the street now. Simple and cost-saving, the model has brought an unexpectedly profound effect to Namjin Komu. The local government expects 10,000 square meters of public areas, including streets, health clinics and people's committee office, to be decorated with flowers by 2018. Besides planting flowers, many practical actions for environmental protection have been promoted by the Women's Union. We are going to propose the local government to resume Green Sundays, cleaning family and worse separation as source models. The union will also call on assistance from fertilizer firms to keep up the work of planting flowers on streets. The efforts to protect environment and improve rural landscape of the district women's union and local people has been paying off with a clean living space which cheers people up and improves public health.